Hey, orange one here. So uh, we're in a bit of a situation here. Um, we have the numbers right now to uh, help out with this battle um, and take them out. But there's a lot of people around us, so we got uh, we got a lot of fighting to do basically right now. So I'm gonna actually tell everyone: listen to your commanders, and then. We'll just get the cavalry on us. It's same strategy as what we've been doing, um, but basically now it's like super important that we don't lose units. So I'm gonna have to be playing a little bit more carefully, trying to just support these guys, and you know, on honestly, probably gonna cheese it a little bit in terms of trying to take out this uh, infantry and archers. Might want to try and get on that hill and then come down from it where that cavalry is. If I could like loop around them. We got far more cavalry than that, what they've got right there. So yeah, I bet we could overpower that cavalry. And then rush down onto the infantry and archers. Or harass them at the very least. Just kinda keep an eye on them. See if they start moving. Nah, I think that we're good. We can definitely approach from an angle where we're not going to be able to get shot. Cool. Alright, yeah. Yeah, we just need to basically distract these guys as much as humanly possible. Follow your sergeants. Yeah, you guys, you can go ahead and start following sergeants. I'm just going to start shooting arrows into the crowd. Don't mind me. And I wanted to keep the thing on so that you guys could see us versus them. Um, oh jeez, oh jeez. But yeah, this is gonna be a little bit tricky for me to keep track of who's where. There we go, I got a hit on that guy. And that dude, nice. And that dude. Okay, yeah, we got a lot of cavalry here, which has gotta be a problem for me. Come on. That dude should have gone down. Okay, but it looks to me like we are starting to turn the tide of battle here. There's quite a few of these dudes still on horseback. But... Um, I am making... some leeway on it. Oh, this guy... is killing me. Well, I killed him, so... Fair is fair, right? Yeah, I think that that went pretty well. Um, better than what the AI would have done with the auto resolve, so we'll roll with that. I'm definitely still nervous though. Um, you're not one of them, are you? No, you're one of ours. Okay, cool. It looks to me like we are good to go off that first battle. Okay. Um, yeah, we we did pretty good there. I'm pretty happy with that. We got about 400 troops still. Um, I'm going to be letting these guys go, uh, because I don't think we're going to get out of this alive. I, I really don't. I think that this is, uh, this is going to be like a last stand kind of situation. So we'll just be getting our troops as much experience as possible. Um, I believe that guy is trying to join my party, right? Uh, yes. He's in army. Does that mean he's he's with me now? If I try and go to that guy, yeah, um, okay, there we go, he's he's with me. Okay, here's the thing, is I want to take out that 80 stack while there's less people around, so I think we'll take him out and then maybe try and take out those three. Um, I can persuade you to join me now. Okay, alright, well, we'll fight you then. We'll do what we gotta do. Um, yeah. Let's get in there, yeah? Same thing. Take over, come Same thing as what I just did. Follow me. Follow me. In fact, follow me. That worked out very well for us, seeing how we only lost 40-something people. If we could do similar style um, combat, I think this actually, we have a much better number advantage. But if we just kind of push it, 
we might be able to get out of this peninsula and not die. I'm very, very hesitant to believe that. But if, I mean, I did pretty well in that last encounter. I, I got a number of hits on people and uh, we did not ourselves get captured. Oh, dude, nice, okay. You guys go ahead and start harassing as you see fit. I'm gonna see if I can take out this other horseman. There we go. Cool. Nice. Oh, nice. Okay, that guy's down. Um, let's see. Oh man, this is going very well. This is just what we needed. We might be able to get out of this peninsula, guys. Oh, wow, we are... Yeah, I, I think that we've invested well in troops right now. Is what I'm, I'm seeing. Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, we don't want uh, these guys to come back another day. There we go. Man, we have such a numbers advantage right now. This is insane. Oh, jeez. Is that a javelin? I think that was a javelin. Uh, oh, God. He gets through there. Yeah, you're one of ours. Okay, cool. Very nice. Okay, so we got a couple things there. That's good. Only three people went down there. Yeah, so if we can push advantages like that, we'll be okay. I'm going to see if maybe we can get around this group and maybe even split them. You know? Like, if they can run away from us, but, like, kind of to the side, then we might be able to kind of get around them. We do have 400 compared to their, like, what is that, 300 right now? So yeah, I kind of, part of me wants to just kind of go off to the side. Part of me wants to see if we can uh, get these guys split. Yeah, I think we can split them up. Sweet. Yeah, let's, let's do that then. Um, yeah, you, you, my friend, are in a bad situation there. So we'll, we'll chase him down. We'll go get him, and then we'll deal with the others. Oh man, this guy's completely by himself. Yeah. Well, you just lost 50 troops, basically. Which I'm, I'm very glad about. Take over command. Um, do I... You know, I'll let the cavalry do what they're gonna do. Micromanaging at this point it seems kind of silly seeing how we've got them outnumbered. Like, I think it's, gosh, like six to one, seven to one, something like that. But yeah, I think Vlandia, after this uh, this peninsula, is gonna have very few troops left. We've already cleared out hundreds of them in the field battles here. I mean, if the Sultan can't take advantage of that, I don't know what to do, you know? Honestly. Um, sorry, give me a second. Okay, let's see. Um, yeah, I think this is going to go pretty quick. I think it already is. Um, I don't see why our cavalry is in there, though, right now, because they're going to get destroyed and we're going to lose some cav. Yeah, this is unfortunate. Yeah, we just lost, I think, a cav, dude. But they're retreating already. Um, that really just happened. Did we not even use our infantry? I think we just didn't even use infantry. I mean, they are mostly recruits and volunteers, so... There's that. Yeah, that was, that was a very quick battle. Um, is that one of them? That is one of them, right? No, that's one of ours. It's one of their units that they've been using, the Batanian horsemen, but it's one of ours. It's kind of confusing with all these factions because we're using each other's, like, units, and the colors get switched, but the units look the same. I mean, nobody's been using Asari, but everyone seems to be using all the other factions here to get for their local war effort. Um, is that... Yeah, that dude right there. A Triari. There we go. 
We're coming for you, Vlandia. <laughs> we really are. Man, crushing it. I, we didn't even lose a single person there. Very cool. All right. Well, um, let's see. Got to get to a point that I can save. I actually got to take a little break right now. Um, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Eight hours later. <laughs> Sorry, I, I really wanted to do that. I've been thinking about it all day. Um, you know the SpongeBob meme where the, it's like an obviously fake French accent. Um, we're going to rinse and repeat what we were trying to do. And it is actually almost eight hours later than when I was recording. Um, I just, there was like, there was some garden beds that are getting delivered today. And I totally forgot about that, basically. And so uh, I had to go like get stuff ready for that. Oh, look, we've got 90 more. Okay, well, uh, I kind of want to go for the 120 right here because we got them kind of isolated. We're going to go for you, though. The safe, the safe bet. And we'll just kind of keep on picking them off. Honestly, this is this is proven to be very effective for us. Um, yep. You, you feel like dying too against 400. Okay, cool. Man, like honestly, this has gone about as good as it possibly could have for Take us. Over, command! This whole like warring it out on the peninsula after this. I think they've probably lost like 400, 500 uh, troops. So I think we take our army that we have here and we siege maybe one of the castles and try and get that down because I think I've been going for the cities a little too fast, basically. Footman! On my bluff mountain! After me! And then, yeah, you guys are following your sergeants anyways, right? Yeah. So yeah, we'll just do like what we've been doing. But yeah, I, uh, I, I'm really excited for the garden. It's kind of like my mom's been saying it, um, it's like a victory garden. Like, I'm mean, English in case you're not aware. And she was comparing it to like her her parents' gardens during like uh, World War II, you know? Everyone follow your sergeants! And it was just kind of cool, you know? It's like this coronavirus thing. Um, it's inspiring some people. Right? Yeah, there's no way, bud. I don't know, I saw something on Reddit about someone call saying like, this is like war crimes, what I'm doing right now. Technically it's not though, so. But I'm sure that uh, they would agree with my, my old roommate about the old Man of War game. I mean, honestly. These guys were about to murder us all, so... I know you're supposed to technically, like, let someone um, surrender if they want to, but, like... It's not, like, beyond reason to say that, like, back in these days, like, you have been so mad at someone who was trying to, uh, you know, kill you, that you wouldn't really think about their rights <laughs> post battle right okay I think that's good yeah we only lost three people that's pretty solid um it's almost gotten to the point where I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna pick up some prisoners because we're gonna be slow moving slow anyways due to our companions um who are gonna be all bogged down with prisoners right now god look at all those banners that's oh dude you can actually see the individual banners on there that is so cool are they on the exact same animation too no it looks like the animations are slightly different or maybe they're off uh timing wise or something i don't know but it looks pretty solid yeah that's um i'm honestly just gonna go for them i don't i don't think uh well, no, we'll we'll try and go to the side a little bit. No, this is proving to be that they're just a little too fast for us. 4.4, 4.5, 3.45. Yeah, they're just too fast for us. I think what we really want to do is siege this castle down and then go for the city. The city, though, may be weakened because we recently took it. Um, 
Let's get our army cohesion up. Again, I still don't know where the, what this takes from. Oh, it took from our influence. Oh, so that actually does take from influence. I guess it maybe it relies on. Um, let's just kind of check out Shiraz. If this guy's going to go inside of it, we might not want to uh, attack it. 150 against 500. Um, I think the castle's got to have a similar amount anyways, so we might as well go to besieging this place. And then honestly, I'm just going to keep an eye out for people trying to counter us. Um, let's go ahead, we'll do a battering ram. And then we'll do like a siege tower over here and another siege tower there. And I'm also intrigued to see, yeah, we've got tons of food. I've basically just been buying a ton of food myself um, in hopes that uh, we would get into a siege scenario here. And if things go correctly, like if we actually do siege these people down here, um, which I think shouldn't be too bad. But if we actually take this place out, um, we'll see. I think that seeing how we've taken out so many of their soldiers, I don't think they'll be able to take it back from us. But I am also going to want to keep an eye on the log that we got down there. Man, that is a lot of looters. Sure, we'll take you guys. I had a feeling. Do you know if your companions take prisoner recruits like what we're doing? I feel like they do, but I could be also wrong about that. Okay, we have 622 people. Oh, look, we actually, I think maybe, nah, it's about the same amount of food. I think I just have like an absurd amount of food right now. Like if I look at my inventory. Yeah, look how much grain I have. I have almost 500 grain just in my inventory. Okay, we're going to start see, um, building siege equipment. It takes a while. Our skill's kind of low. I think, honestly, that that skill should go up. I could put another focus point in it. Though, you know, I'm... Part of me is thinking, like, well, Rodan, he's, he's not really a warrior. But then again, I'm leading an army of, like, 600 people in the siege against this place. So I don't know how much we can say that we're not a warrior. And look, they've got like 30 there. Like, that's pathetic. That army strength is absolutely tiny. And I think, honestly, that we may pull people towards us, but then other uh, units should be able to attack other places. Um, I think that they're as prepared as they're gonna be, but we are we could have more siege equipment. So I'm gonna actually... Um... Oh, these actually have different build costs. I see. Oh, so we can do like ballistas and they're like super cheap. Um, sure, do like a ballista. Okay, we got 700 against the troops in here. I think we should probably... Uh, <laughs> should we... Attack and then go inside the city walls? Or should we fight these guys out first, out here? Man, it is literally like our numbers compared to their numbers are insane. But they've got like 300 something recruits compared to... Okay, I can't even see how many recruits we have because there's so many units in our army. Um, we've got like... Okay, actually, we've got like 226 compared to the... How many was it? 318. And they've got all those Batanian volunteers. Hmm. Okay, this could be... Because um, we're going to lose a good amount of people trying to get in here. And then I'm a little bit worried about our speed being 2.2 compared to 3 and them catching us. Yeah, I think that we need to, unfortunately, call this off. Yeah. Go on. Um, and we need to just get into this fight, honestly. I think that we, we can take them. 
We just kind of need to do it. Um, they do actually now have a good amount of units. That this may be, this may be, uh, <laughs> this may not be a smart thing to do. Um, oh, maybe I can convince you to join me. Oh, okay. Maybe we can, uh, we can get someone to turn here. If uh, I get one more success, I think that he'll, uh, he'll join me. Oh no. There we go. He'll join me. Um, whatever you want, honestly, mate. Wait, you'll, you'll take, you take like nothing, honestly. I'm going to give you a good amount because you're about to lose some, uh, some troops in this fight. Oh, look, they're actually already <clears throat> trying to fight it out there. I think we got to do it. This is a... Are they not actually going to get in on the fight? I don't think they are. Sweet. Okay, let's, uh, let's wipe the floor with the Vlandians. Um, okay, <laughs> we have so many people here. The game Sergeant, is like, I don't know who to tell what to do. Woodman, follow me! Out Okay, all of the cavalry on me. Same strategy as we've been doing. There's just, you know, like over 1,500 units now that are going to be involved in this battle. So that actually means that they're going to have some reinforcements coming in, probably, like halfway through the battle. So we want to ideally pull them out, but I don't think our sergeants are going to do that. Uh, hold on. Let's not do that. Let's just get the cav, like, over here. Oh, uh, they've got their cab on that hill. They've got their whole army on that hill. Oh, man. We're gonna maybe lose people trying to take them out on that hill. But we gotta take the cab and go around then. That's basically what has to happen, is take the cab and harass from the, the rear while our units start raining down some pain on them. They're gonna start shooting at our horse archers any minute now. I'm kind of surprised they aren't. Oh, look. Sprout. Uh, Sprout? Who's got the name Sprout? Are they like Groot's cousin or something? Okay, there's a... Uh, it looks like they're colliding. I think we just need to get in there. Oh, I, uh... Yeah. I think we just need to get... In. Oh, I just hit a shield. Just honestly, just hit someone. Okay, there's a lot of our guys around here. I think that we're yeah, we're crushing it right now. Like if you look at the the, the thing on the top of the screen there, we're doing just fine. Okay, yeah, we're doing we're doing great. <laughs> I'm, I'm enjoying this chaos. These guys, the AI is not very good at dealing with cavalry in their, their ranks. Um, but, well, there is also the fact that there's like hundreds of us compared to them. Like honestly, this field is just covered in people right now. Are you what I think? Yeah, you're one of them. <laughs> The AI can't even handle where to aim at. Okay. Oh no, 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 no. No, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Oh, okay, I'm out, actually. Time to go commit more uh, war crimes. Come on, horse, giddy up. It's time to take care of those, like, 300-something, uh, recruits. Yeah. That... If that doesn't cause us to be able to take, uh, this city and the next couple cities, then I don't know what will. God, this is insane. Look at how many of them are running away. 
there's no way that we're going to be able to get all of them. I'm honestly looking for ones that are already wounded. Uh, well, at least I'm getting us a, uh, a good feel for the timing. And the weapon range and whatnot, right? Oh, come on, 98 damage. Wait, there's still people killing our, my guys. There's actual fighting going on right now. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's starting to glitch out with the cheering. It's starting to actually be like, I kind of like that sound because it's like a, like a Pavlonian response now. Okay, no, I don't. I don't actually like that. That's pretty awful still. Uh, you know what? You're free to go. I think we've won. But I'm going to get my charm up. And... Yeah, there's a lot of prisoners here. I don't think that we're going to be running away from this, though. So we'll take all those prisoners in the off chance that I'll be able to get some as recruits. And I think we're going to continue sieging that city. Now, we did lose all the siege equipment that we built, unfortunately. Um... We're going to have prisoners escaping the party. Now let's get rid of some of them then. Uh, how many do I have? Oh, I need to get rid of like 20 of them. Well, is that good? Yes, that's good. Cool. That's pretty much exactly what we needed to do. And I mean, we did just defeat like a the biggest army I think I've ever defeated. So there should be some good armor from that, right? Um, let's just get on this, honestly. I think we've got the troops to still take this, even right now, and we're gonna heal up, so... I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Um, let's go ahead, we'll, we'll do the same thing that we did last time and just do something like that. And I think, yeah, we actually have about this, enough food to, for the same amount of time. Well, I mean, they sallied out and they tried to meet us. I mean, you gotta hand it to them. They did actually do quite a bit of damage to us. And we do have, like, 350 prisoners right now. Okay, Ospear, you coming is gonna be kind of annoying. You're way faster than me, so I can't really do much about it. I mean, we could just honestly try and attack the castle now, but the losses that we'll take are, are gonna... Um, what? Really? Really? Uh... I don't think there's much that I can do about this. I don't think I have a choice. I think I have to fight this. They have pretty much the um, the same amount of people as I do. Oh my god. This is insane. Do I have any prisoners that want to join me? No? A few? Oh god. This is gonna be bad. I think that they might they might beat us now. I'm just gonna get the cohesion up. I don't know if that actually helps us in battle or not, but uh, I think we need it. <laughs> God, we've got so much of our king's army together right now. Yeah, if we get crushed here, we get crushed here. There wasn't much that I really could have done about it. Um. I mean, I could tell him to just go away. I could just pay him off. Uh, let's see. You actually already like me. So maybe I can... I, uh, I could just tell these guys to go away. <laughs> How's our power level? I think that we've got this in the bag, though. I think that we'll win this. There's an, a whole lot of them, though. We'll fight you to the last drop. Yeah. We're gonna do it. I, I feel like I should be um, trying to convince them to not fight. But they really want to fight. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna be mostly recruits like we saw last a uh, couple times. Okay. Let's do it. Let's stop talking and let's just do it. Yeah. Follow your sergeants! And then... Follow me! Follow me! Soldiers! After me! 
Oh man, I actually am nervous for this one. They actually have... It looks like pretty much a 50-50 uh, split in terms of numbers. Like, they have the, the same number of troops as we do. So we better hope that um, people leveled up their uh, people from the last battle. <laughs> oh man, this is going to be the deciding victory. If we get caught in this, I'm not even going to be that mad. Because I, I feel like we put up the best fight we could have. Though we could have just been like, yo, dudes, like, uh, there's no need for us to fight. You know? Okay, let's uh, get the cavalry a little bit further over here, because they do have a whole lot of cavalry right there looking at us. How are we doing over there? Um, there's archers. I'm going to try and sneak up on their archers a little bit. Yeah, I think we need to just get in there now. Just be like, hey, uh, everybody listen to your sergeant. Yeah. And I'm gonna distract the cavalry as much as possible. Come over here, guys. I know, I smell fantastic. Oh god, look at all those troops. Look at all those troops. There's so many of them. I like, honestly, my arrows are not gonna even make a difference in this fight. <laughs> I honestly feel that way. Um, we have taken a fair amount of losses there. More than I am, I am comfortable admitting to. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to win this. Uh, we might, we might not. I think we need to honestly get these horses distracted. I think that's probably our the best uh, impact that I can have is distracting cavalry and maybe killing them. Because they have a lot of them. Yeah, they have a lot of cavalry here. Oh look, we've, we're, we're crushing it. There's, uh, look at the top of the screen. I don't know when that changed, but that is uh, looking a lot better all of a sudden. Oh, come on. Yeah, I agree with whatever that guy was saying, because he just said, ah, come on. There we go. There we go. I do need more arrows, though, because I'm not going to be able to finish these dudes off. Uh, with only one arrow. So I need to find some archer somewhere. They actually have um, a lot of cavalry right now, which is concerning to me. Uh, you're one of our dudes. Yeah, they are killing a whole lot of us right now. Actually, you know what's killing a whole lot of us is, is crossbowmen. Yeah, we need to attack them. Guys, why are you not charging in here? Oh, because you've got a lot of ranged units as well. I see. Okay. Understandable. There we go. Okay, good. I think that we've got them on the run, though. Oh. There. <laughs> God, they they really did a number on us, though. I think after this, that we gotta we gotta be a little bit more cautious. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to catch this dude. I think there's not much choice that I have, though, honestly. After this battle, we're gonna be so slow and we're gonna have so many prisoners because the AI always takes prisoners. Oh, that's actually one of my dudes. Oh. Oh, jeez. Dude, you just went flying. There we go. Someone just did the same thing to him. That is perfect. Um, well. I think that that is a good point for us to end this episode at. Good god. Um, I'm gonna let you free go free. Go come right back to me. I know that you will. Um, hold on. No. <laughs> we gotta get rid of, like, all of our prisoners, basically. 
Which is funny because like I've not been collecting prisoners for like forever now and now I I have a ton of them. Just like out of nowhere. Not out of nowhere, after like battling some of the biggest battles I've ever seen in uh in this game. Um sure. That looks good to me. My god. Okay, now we only have a hundred people, but we do have a lot more than that. They're just kinda healing up. Um, I think I'm going to end this episode here, though. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.